Uh, and one of the biggest fears with COVID-19 is the damage it's having on the economy. Businesses are trying to take advantage of several government programs, such as Small Business Administration disaster loan assistance. But as Jason Colthorpe reports, some workers are falling through the cracks. A lot of these businesses are desperate, especially employees who are not working right now. And as all these loan applications get processed, some business owners are finding the money just isn't flowing like they thought. We currently have six 1099 employees. We've been around since 1997, 23 years. Ed Steele owns RT Software Systems of Berkeley, basically providing an IT department for companies that don't have one in-house. He was also in the middle of a massive data expansion. We're actually working on the, the 6th Precinct Police Department from Detroit. We bought that from Detroit City, and we're in the middle of changing that into another cloud computing data center. That all stopped with the stay-at-home orders. He tried to take advantage of the Fed's loan lifelines to small businesses. They sent me a Dear John letter, sorry, not good enough credit. In 23 years of business, Steele never had a bankruptcy, but also never took out a loan. And he says his credit score had fallen 193 points to 528 in the last month because of one late payment. And I was actually shocked because I wouldn't think that a, a pandemic would and support to help a business in a pandemic would depend on whether I had good credit. Whether I never see a dime or I do, this money would have gone right in a U-turn straight into the pockets of the guys that aren't working right now. But those guys are technically independent contractors, not employees, and that's why they're falling through the cracks. The big attraction to this yeah. is that if you can demonstrate that you maintained your payroll or increased it, then you're gonna get this loan forgiven. Yeah, and he obviously a lot of these businesses can't do that if they don't have actual staff. That's right, that's exactly right. right. My opinion is aid means aid, it doesn't mean I must jump through hoops to get aid. It's unclear why Steele's personal credit score was the deciding factor here, but O'Keefe says at the end of the day, this is a loan, and with so many businesses applying, everything could be on the table. In Berkeley, Jason Colthorpe, Local 4.